What is good for the bottom line is not always good for America and working families, Senator Marco Rubio, our Florida, says. In speech to conservatives outlining his vision for a new nationalism and taking sharp aim at China, Rubio argued Thursday if America relies only on market forces to determine its course, the nation will come up short, the Miami Herald reported. We are weakened by an economic elitism that has replaced a commitment to the dignity of work with a cult-like faith in financial markets, Rubio told conservatives at the Faith and Freedom Coalition's Road to Majority Conference in Washington, the Herald reported. When right and wrong is based solely on profitability, then there is nothing immoral in shipping jobs overseas or surrendering key American technology and innovation to China. Rubio has been critical of the administration's approach to China in recent months. The Harold noted, and his remarks came just hours after the Trump administration announced Chinese telecom giant ZTE will pay a $1 billion fine after it was caught shipping communications equipment to North Korea and Iran, and lying to U.S. Investigators about it need policies that view Americans as human beings who cannot flourish without the sense of accomplishment, pride and sufficiency that comes with a good-paying job, Rubio said. Which is why we cannot allow China to continue to cheat and steal their way into a position of dominance in these industries and need to spur American investment in the manufacturing of the future and support American companies. When they help American workers, Rubio's speech argued conservatives need to alter an economic message that preaches economic elitism, or they will lose control to Democrats preaching cultural elitism as China gains more power at America's expense. We need both policies and a culture that will value and support the family, Rubio said, the Herald reported. Many powerful people were infuriated when I demanded we expand the child tax credit as part of tax reform. But I ask you what I asked myself then, how could the Republican Party find hundreds of billions of dollars to give to multinational corporations, many of which care little about our country, but not cut? the taxes of hard-working families trying to make ends meet and provide for their children, politics if America relies only on market forces to determine its course, the nation will come up short, Sen. Marco Rubio, our Florida, argued in a speech Thursday, per the Miami Herald. New nationalism, economy, China, innovation, GDP 380 Thursday the 7th of June 2018 8.25 p.m. 2018 Thursday the 7th of June 2018 8.25 p.m. Newsmax Inc. Newsmax Inc. Newsmax Inc.